Stunning news today that one of the most inspiring athletes in the world has been charged with murder. Oscar Pistorius, the first double-leg amputee to compete on a track in the Olympics. He is charged with shooting his girlfriend. Details are still emerging. And ABC's Bazi Kanani, our correspondent based in Africa, has the news from his home in Pretoria, South Africa tonight. And there's the start in a land-breaking... Who would have imagined the man who did this could end up like this, accused of murder of his girlfriend, Riva Steenkamp, a well-known model in South Africa, seen here in a cell phone commercial and a fixture on the red carpet. The two of them were a couple that demanded attention. Pistorius lives in this luxury estate behind 10 feet high walls and electric fence. Here in South Africa, crime is rampant, and that may be one of the reasons for the rumors going around here that he may have shot his girlfriend, mistaking her for an intruder. But police have other suspicions. Police said there had been incidents in the past at the home, and they had received reports of neighbors hearing shouting before the shooting. And confirmed that there has previously been incidents at the home of, of Mr. Oscar Pistorius, of allegations of domestic nature. Now Pistorius begins to fly. Pistorius' story of determination was legendary. His legs amputated when he was just 11 months old, but with a pair of prosthetic blades, he was as fast as lightning. I'm blessed. I've been given a phenomenal talent and I work extremely hard to be where I am. Nicknamed Blade Runner, he rose to Paralympics champion and the first double amputee to compete in the Olympics. But today, as word of the shooting spread, this Nike ad with the words, I am the bullet in the chamber, was taken down from his sight. He is someone who is celebrated as a humanitarian. To be in this position, it's just shocking. Just yesterday, Steenkamp tweeted, what do you have up your sleeve for your love tomorrow? A day that would end in tragedy, leaving a world of admirers asking how an athlete who embodied a spirit of overcoming any obstacle is now facing a murder charge. Bazi Kanani, ABC News, Pretoria, South Africa.